Get ready guys! In this video, I'm going to show you the Game Hub 4.1.5 and 2 the setup on Android, and trust me, this is one of the fastest versions ever of the Game Hub emulator 100%. It's specially designed for higher FPS, and compared to the original emulator, this beast gives you up to 20% extra FPS boost. Why? Because it pushes your Android system to use the full power of your CPU and GPU, unlocking the smoothest gameplay you've ever seen. Before we jump into the setup, let's check out some gameplay to see how it really runs. Here, as you can see, we're playing Mortal Kombat 11, and it's running at a full 60 out of 60 FPS. Now, if I try the same game on the original emulator, you'll notice a big difference FPS stays locked at just 30 to 40 FPS. But with this version, there's no compromise at all, same settings, but full performance unlocked. And the best part? It's not only about one game, almost every title runs smoother with higher FPS, and it works great across all kinds of devices. Watch carefully guys, because what you're about to see will blow your mind, the performance difference is unbelievable. So here it is, the brand new Game Hub and Tutu update. This version looks a bit different from the regular Game Hub, and it's built on app version 4.1.5. After a quick Google login, the interface will look almost the same as Game Hub. From here, just go to Add PC Game, and select your game. For me, I'm running GTA 5 Lite, which is nearly three times smaller in size compared to the original version. The moment you add your game, this emulator automatically starts updating drivers according to your device. No extra effort needed. Once that's done, head straight into the settings. Don't worry guys, the settings are the same as Game Hub. But here's the real magic. This version delivers 20 to 30% higher FPS performance. So get ready, because this setup is going to make your gameplay smoother and faster than ever before. Under General, make sure to adjust the resolution according to your device. Scroll down to Compatibility, and use the latest Proton version, it works the same on both MediaTek and Snapdragon devices. Next, in Translation Params, if your device is MediaTek, keep it on Game Presets. If you have a Snapdragon 8 Elite or any other device, you can choose Performance Mode, or for the best results, Extreme Mode is recommended. Under GPU Driver, if you have a Mali device, select System Driver. For any Snapdragon device with an unknown CPU, like Snapdragon 8 Lite, also choose System Driver, this will use your device's native driver for maximum speed. If your Snapdragon device has a mainstream CPU, like Light Adreno 6XX or 7XX, you can use the latest Turnip Driver, which is now available as version 25 or 19. Next, under DXVK settings, if you have a MediaTek device, you'll see 1.10.3 Mali underscore fix, select it. If it's not available, you can choose 1.10.3 Async. For any Snapdragon device, always select 2.3.1. And that's it, congratulations! Congratulations, your setup is complete. Now just run your game and enjoy high FPS gameplay, better than GameHub or any other emulator. Guys, after testing this emulator thoroughly, I have to say, the FPS is completely stable and smooth across all the games I tried. No matter whether it's a high-end title or a lighter game, the performance stays consistent, and there's absolutely no lag or stutter. What impressed me the most is how well it utilizes the device hardware. Both CPU and GPU are fully pushed, so you're getting the maximum possible performance without any compromise. Even on devices that usually struggle with heavy games, this emulator manages to deliver high FPS gameplay, better than most other emulators out there. Overall, it feels like a perfectly optimized gaming experience, everything runs exactly as it should. The settings are simple, and it's extremely reliable. If you want smooth, stable, and fast gameplay on your Android, this emulator is definitely one of the best options available right now. That's the score! Oh, there's enough here for us all to enjoy! Depends on how you look at it. Come on, move it! Come on out, B! Give it up! Uh, I got him! Uh, I saw your face, I'll remember you! You forget a thousand things every day. How about you make sure this is one of them? I've seen his eyes! Great! I'm ready to do this, now get him covered! I'm setting the charges. They're on a timer, so brace yourselves. Oh, fuck, you hear that? Siren, fuck the cops. T, hit the shutter switch. You're an idiot. You shouldn't have been a cop. I ain't laying down for them. Move! We're coming through! Get out of the way! Fuck these guys! 
What the fuck is this? They answered the wrong call! Bring it to him! 